This is the energy vibration reading for the Cancer Sun Moon Horizon sign for um, the second week of February. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful um, surprise shares. Um, listen to your Sun Moon Horizon sign, and I want to say to each and every person, thank you for being here. Whatever the situation is. Whatever that is transpiring, the devil is in reverse. So that is good for you, Kansas. The tower is taking the devil down, and it's taken also down the princess of sword. This is good. She was working on some um, um, ego base energy, and the tower is taking her down now. I'm seeing the king of pentacles and the princess of wands that is in your stability so if some of you could be connected now I'm seeing a victorious success against the Queen of Pentacles and uh, the Queen of Swords now whoever this Queen of Swords is she is a um, whoever this Queen of Swords is she is a um, Aquarius Gemini or Libra and uh, definitely um, <laughs> you're taking her down okay um, so whatever she comes with with her little lies and little um, situation and little lies and this and this and that you're definitely taking her down now the king of one has gone um, the, the king of Pentacles someone who's four to five years and older I've gone on with a princess of wands <laughs> okay so all right let's get in this reading let's get in this reading the week is an earth star week and the zodiac energy is here you have two air signs you're dealing with an, a young lady between the ages of 18 and 45 this is an Aquarius Gemini or Libra this could also be your child what we're seeing here is the energy of the the devil and the tower now this is so good um, because some of you were dealing with a, um, an Aquarius Gemini or Libra and th this 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 was really a nasty relationship and the tower came down and took it down okay so two of ones is air ace of swords is here and uh, um, whatever the situation is is that uh, um, if your wife was um, younger than you and she was between the age of 18 and 45 she has gone forward with an older man that is the Knight of Pe Pentacles that is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn so here we go ladies and gentlemen wheel of fortune wheel of fortune now finally the energy of the devil has been torn down whatever the situation is the energy of the devil has been torn down okay um there was some just some lies lies oh okay oh okay um there was some lies well all right for you um uh cancer so you have the two of ones whatever is happening let's see um, Monday is a fire energy Tuesday is a hair energy um, the center of the week is the energy of the devil which is fire you're dealing with an Aries or you're dealing with people with ego base energy of the tower is here oh yeah and then the tower has to do with the princess of swords whoever this princess of swords is she is out cold okay now if you and whoever out there um, was in a relationship with an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius um, between the ages of 18 and 45 but she has moved on with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn yay okay let's see what's happening two of ones what is this all about two of ones is about some of you that is in a relationship with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion this could be your child okay um, some of you could be realizing that you're pregnant with twins um, some of you could be realizing that this person has two faces or some of you could be realizing that this person has gotten an offer and an end is coming to a situation okay so there's a lot that is going on so some of you could have realized it could be a child that was in some problem there was a child that was in some problem and uh, they have gotten an offer okay so a child 
was in some problem they have gotten an offer and this offer is going to be helping them out okay so a child that was having some problems some legal problems or situation like that you're going to be realizing that they have gotten an offer and this offer is going to end the situation with them and it's going to be helping them out and giving them a new start so this is good congratulations you young people between the ages of 18 and 45 you could receive a new offer of work of offer out of a, a negative situation and it's going to be um, take it because um, this is going to be very good it's going to give you a new start okay ace of swords is here our love is going to be coming in the nine of cups ace of swords is here love is going to be coming in the nine of cups ace of swords is here love is going to be coming in the nine of cups so this is going to be good this is going to be positive there is energy of the ace of swords I see, and the energy of the nine of cups which is so positive okay energy of the devil is here whatever the situation is with the energy of the devil let's look at this energy of the devil has to do with a family situation the energy of the devil has to do with a family situation whatever the situation is it has to do with a family situation okay and this is no longer playing out this is no longer playing out okay so that's it that's that's really good because whatever the situation is it's no longer playing out okay so there was an evil um, situation it was so it says you were bound to someone or someone was bound to you and this is no longer the situation you're being released from whatever that was bound in you together okay the energy of the tower comes in what's here oh yeah this energy of the tower this is with um, whoever this person is this person is and Aries Leo or um, Aquarius Gemini or Libra and the tower taken down so that means that's the end of is rain bye bye to do to to do he's a and this is an Aquarius Gemini or Libra whoever this person is and he's gonna be finding himself in some real hard times and that's good for him so there was an um, Aquarius Gemini or Libra um, that was in legal you in a situation and has come between the family now the tower is taking him down and he is in some real shitty position okay there is an Aquarius Gemini um, there is this Aquarian Gemini or Libra a child and the organization um, there's an organization she has to um, report to an organization and um, it's coming to an end Ooh, la, la. so you you um, you cancers you cancers really it's a karmatic this week is the end of because the world is the end of situation and new beginnings obviously there's a lot of karmatic situation that is taking place the wheel of fortune is here and this is good so the energy of the wheel of fortune is that um, karma is coming full circle karma is coming full circle you young people between the ages you can see that the karma is coming full circle because if you're in a legal situation or you got caught up in something you are definitely going to be offered something and they're going to be releasing you and giving you a new start okay and by the, um, speaking of, you know whatever the situation is with some of you you are, are going to be um, communicating and letting um, others know that you care about them you're really going to be communicating and letting others know that you care about them then we have the energy of the devil in reverse so there was um, someone or some um, ego based situation that was affecting your family and this is now in reverse it is no longer bonding you now some of you were dealing with an Aquarius Gemini or Libra <laughs> bye bye oh my OMG 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 Jesus finally now there is um, the um, there is um, an Aquarius Gemini or Libran lady she's in the reverse with the organization and end has come to her king of Pentacles justice come up against the king of Pentacles okay 
um, justice um, for the King of Pentacles. A justice for the King of Pentacles. What else is coming out? And the um, conflicts is now over. Five of Wands. A justice come for the King of Pentacles and the conflicts is now over. Whatever the situation is, justice come for the King of Pentacles and the conflicts is now over. The Princess of Wands is seeing a truth to a situation. Okay. So it's as if whatever the situation that has transpired between you, if you were in a relationship with an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius, she's seen this situation. She's seen um, whatever to a situation and the cruelty that has transpired. She is really seeing um, the truth to a situation and the cruelty that has transpired. Okay really seeing the truth to a situation and the cruelty that has transpired so um wow okay so whoever this princess of one is she's seen and and, and she sees this as a lesson been learned okay so you 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 can sir so Wow, it's a week for you, Kansas. Wow. Okay. Oh boy. Mm -mm -mm. Okay. Um, whoever you, Kansas, was that was dealing with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn man, this conflict is now finally over. So if you were dealing with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn man, this conflict is now finally over. Whatever the conflict was, it is now finally over. Okay, and happiness is going to be returned because you speak your truth, and um, by speaking your truth, um, this this the situation is going to be finally over. Okay, so that is good. And whatever the conflict was, you kind of get this person out of a con out of a situation without even knowing. Okay, so you um mm, you uh, cancers whatever the situation is, um the conflict is now over. And um it, this could be a brother or something like that. Okay, now um the conflict is now over. And you're out of this situation now whoever it is um, that was dealing with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius she found out that you were seeing a um, Aquarius Gemini or Libra she found out that you were seeing an Aquarius Gemini or Libra and um, an organization is going to definitely end this relationship okay so you cancers whoever you are that has been cheating if you were if you are in a relationship or you were married to an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius she found out what you have done with an um, Aries Leo um, with an Aquarius Gemini or Libra and an organization is going to step in so this could be um, immigration or whatever whoever that you have to deal with but as a government institute is going to come in and hand this relationship with this person yeah oh wow for the rest um you young can you young cancers between the ages of 18 and 45 um, you're going to be really receiving a new job offer for some of you or if you're in a legal situation you're going to be receiving an offer and you're going to be getting out really um, communicate with your partner because as you communicate with your partner a lot of happiness and joy your wishes and dreams are going to be happening okay mm. with the family there was a lot of uneven energies and it was all um, karmatic situation there that you know you can just have gone through some real horrible things some of you cancers who are in a relationship with an Aquarius Gemini or Libra it's coming to an end yep yeah and if you are married to an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius, she's making sure that it comes to an end because she see the cruelty that has transpired with her. So it's as if you were married to an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius and uh, someone who was younger than you are, and she wasn't aware of what was going on. 
but justice is um, going to be coming in and um, giving her a end up of what has been transpired so it's a, someone is going to be and what is going to be happening is that 999 um, an ending to a situation 999 is an ending to a situation 999 ending to a situation and then ending ending to a situation okay um whoever you order is and who um whoever you order is um in a relationship with an aquarius um gemini or libra it's coming to an end and this person um ooh you thought it was the love of your life bam <laughs> my wishes and dream came true with this person coming to an end Okay, and you might think that I'm I'm being very horrible now, but um, what has transpired is that, uh, and this is only for the people who were in a relationship with an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. You have played this person, and she is very upset. You have played this person; she's very upset, and um, she's going to get back at you so horrible because it's an Aries. If you were in a relationship with an Aries, it's an it's a karmatic lesson that you need to learn. So whoever out there that was married or in a relationship with an Aries, there is a karmatic lesson that you should learn. And this karmic lesson is actually letting you know that you had um, like the wheel of fortune in your hands, but you wanted too much. You wanted too much, too fast, and the rest of it, okay? some of you that is connected maybe it is your daughter um, or uh, you know she could have done something that's an Aquarius Gemini or Libra and um, her reign in organization is over her reign in organization is over I'm seeing the the the, the, um, the people who were who have connection with the um, Aquarius Gemini and Libra people whatever has transpired um, they are going to be feeling the end of the stick and it's not going to be good because it's going to be a huge broomstick and this is going to let them feel what they have put on this true gotta go we have the energy of two cards here we have card one and card two now Live your soul. Live your soul, not a role. Okay, this is supposed to rhyme. Live your soul, not a role. Now they want you to live your soul, divine purpose, and don't live your life as a role. They really want to live your soul, divine purpose, and by doing that, they really want to connect with that you connect with your soul. That is all they're asking you for, okay? Do what you love, okay? So whatever you love to do in work or whatever makes you happy, do that. Because then you will be living your soul purpose, okay? Then you will feel connected with your soul purpose. And this is all that they're saying to you. So live your own soul role by doing what you love the most. Namaste, until next time.